started cutting meat for Omaha Steaks in 1984. And I'm proud of what we do. I love what I do so much because I'm passionate about food. Very quality steak experience can bring everybody together. Today we're talking about the butcher's cut steak. Jerry, what exactly is the butcher's cut? Talk to me. The butcher's cut line is exclusive Doma steaks. Double trim loin, all right, a well marbled loin, all steaks aged at least 30 days. In the lineup, you have filet mignons, porterhouse, ribeyes, New York strips, and top sirloins. Everybody wants a thicker, juicier steak. All right, so Jerry, what's so great about how these are trimmed? Double trim, explain that to me, please. Okay, they're double trim. First off, they're hand trim. We're looking for a certain size steak. The steak's gonna be thicker, all right? Thicker steak, I'm taking it from you. That's easier to prepare. Thicker steak, juicier steak, as a chef and as a consumer, it makes it a lot easier for me to zone in and really nail that perfect cooking temperature. It's a lot more appealing. All right, so so many times as a chef and as a consumer, I hear all the time, you take the steak home, you're gonna go ahead and prep and trim and take all that excess fat off there. So you're essentially paying for something you're not gonna use, cook, or eat. So the great thing about the butcher's line, you take all that guesswork and labor out of the equation, it cuts down on my prep time, I'm not trimming excess fat because it's already been done for me. Less time prepping, more time eating. So Chef, yes. you know about aging. Mm -hmm. How does that make it better for me, easier for you? A well-edged steak is tender, great flavor. It's bringing out those natural nuances, that nuttiness, that sweetness, that natural, robust, beefy flavor that is highly coveted by everybody. At 10 days, still a very firm loin. Yeah. At 20 days, starting to give out. At 30 days, a nice, tender, Easy to work with, easy to chew. So 10 days, flexed, yep. 30 days, a little, little relax. Yep. Got so it. 10 right. days, <laughs> 30 days. <laughs> All right, Jerry, what is marbling and why do I want this fat as opposed to the fat that you trim off? Marbleization is the, the quality, shows the quality of the beef, the internal, the, the fat in the muscle, all right? We get the heavy fat on the outside, some of that goes away, makes it a butcher's cut, all right? Yeah. Fat inside gives you that quality that you want. Fat is flavor, and that inner muscular fat marbleization is gonna melt, it's gonna render down, it's gonna evaporate literally into that meat. So you want that marbleization, it's key to that nice juicy bite. And as we're targeting butcher's cut, that's what we're looking for. I know that's what I'm looking for. Yep, me too. <laughs> Now, Jerry, explain to me exactly what is flash freezing and why doing that process here at Omaha Steaks makes it that much more superior than your local grocery store. The flash freezing is just our process of taking the steak from a, a fresh stage to a completely frozen stage in a very short period of time. We wanna lock in that flavor. We wanna lock in the age where it was. We want it to arrive at your house just like it came off our table. Now essentially what you're telling me is that you're pressing that pause button at Omaha Steaks where it's being frozen at the peak of tenderness, as opposed to your local grocery store where it decays and wastes away day by day in that window. This is being enjoyed the way it's being intended to eat and consumed, and it's only gonna be eaten and consumed when I thaw it out. Jerry, I am thoroughly impressed. The butcher's cut line is a big deal. I think I'm gonna cook something right now. Right now? Be right back. Okay. Dinner is served. Tender, juicy, in your face, beefy flavor to the butcher's cut. Man, you guys gotta try this. This is phenomenal. Don't. <laughs> Come on in. Get your piece. 